An Arctic invasion is underway, and tens of millions are in its path. A quick-moving storm system is pushing east, bringing snow, freezing rain and gusty winds to the eastern two-thirds of the country, even as a surging cold front ushers in record-breaking cold temperatures. We do have the potential for some snow in the forecast tonight and into tomorrow as this Arctic cold front moves in, Fox News senior meteorologist Janice Dean said on Fox Friends, we're going to see record-setting cold as well as winter weather advisories for over 60 million folks. Winter weather advisories have been issued stretching from the plains to the Midwest, Ohio Valley and into the Northeast. The National Weather Service's Weather Prediction Center said the Arctic intrusion is going to bring heavy snow with the potential for freezing rain for a wide swath of New York. The snow was falling from the plains and into the Midwest on Monday morning, with between 2 to 5 inches expected to accumulate the Chicago area. Driving conditions were already described as treacherous with spinouts reported. Airlines at Chicago's O'Hare and Midway airports have canceled hundreds of flights as the snow arrived in the region. As the storm system moves east, between 6 to 12 inches of snow with locally higher amounts are forecast for northern upstate New York and northern Vermont by Wednesday morning. Snow accumulations of up to a foot are also expected stretching into Maine along the Canadian border. Measurable snow, especially across interior sections of the northeast and some of that will, possibly, get into the coastal areas tomorrow behind the cold front, Dean said. We're going to see plenty of snow in some of those areas, our first measurable snow of the season. As the cold air enters the northeast and mid-Atlantic on Tuesday, some areas could see rain changing to snow as the Arctic front passes off the coast. The bitter cold is also expected to trigger lake effect snow that could total more than a foot in parts of New York. Behind the strong Arctic front, widespread cold temperatures that will likely set record low temperatures across many locations from the plains eastward to the east coast and down into the deep south will be set in place by Wednesday. In fact, below freezing temperatures are forecast as far south as the central Texas coast by Wednesday morning, the WPC said. This will make it feel like in the middle of winter rather than in November for much of the eastern two-thirds of the country for the next few days. Cities in the Midwest such as Chicago will only see a high of 20 degrees on Tuesday, while places such as New York City will barely climb above the freezing mark on Wednesday. Conditions are expected to moderate and dry out by later in the week into the weekend, according to forecasters.